Hey everyone, I'm Zach Cipriano, and guess what? It's December! That means the Christmas season is officially here! Yeah, that means family parties, Christmas caroling, shopping. Geez, things can get pretty busy. But that doesn't mean you don't have enough time to try something new. The big question is, what do you do? Where do you go? Well, I've got the answers for you today on our travel adventure. There's something magical about December. The world takes on a crisp, cold beauty as weather patterns change and it seems even the clouds have a story worth telling. The holiday season is one of tales told around the fire, memories spun from Christmas's past. Those experiences can be found at well-known destinations full of light and music, or off the beaten path where the snow drifts deep and the elk bugle at sunrise. That's where we begin our adventure this week. Just south of Logan, Utah, Highway 101 weaves its way through Blacksmith Fork Canyon. After about 10 miles, you come to Hardware Ranch, a destination where Santa Claus himself would go to find replacements if his reindeer ever needed a sick day. Hundreds of elk come down from the mountains in search of food each year, and they find it right here, much to the thrill of children and adults alike. Well, it's a family destination and you can do it probably as low as an hour, but we certainly invite people to come up and take their time and enjoy the country and the elk. As the snow deepens, you can take sleigh rides, help feed the animals, and appreciate the wildlife both at the ranch and in the nearby hills. And if you happen to take the drive up here, you'll also be rewarded with far more options for your weekend than you probably realize. We have 183 miles of groomed snowmobile trail up here and some informal tubing and sledding hills, the visitor center here, and you can go a lot of places from this direction. So it really is a family destination, and I think you make of it what you want for a family day. Now, if you want to stay closer to the Wasatch Front for your holiday adventures, there are other options that you might not have thought of. Of course, you have Temple Square in downtown Salt Lake with its impressive lights and Mormon Tabernacle Choir performances. But just south in Provo, you can see light displays and maybe hit a water slide or two while you're at it. Who'd have thought you could find a North Pole adventure at Seven Peaks Water Park? Best way to describe it, it's a mini Christmas theme park. It has uh, five main attractions, the Nutcracker uh, Story Ride, the Lazy River Christmas Cruise. We have the Candy Cane Slopes, you basically slide down a slide. And then we have Santa, and we have the Seven Peaks Express, which is a train ride. Let's do this! Now let's say slides aren't enough for you, because let's be honest, you can never get enough downhill winter thrills. Another stop will quench your sledding thirst. Along I-80, right before you get to Park City, you'll find a tubing haven that makes walking up a sled hill completely passe. It's Gorgoza Park. We have seven tubing lanes, four upper lanes and three lower lanes. So our upper lanes, about 1,200 feet long. Our lower lanes are a little bit shorter at about 500 feet long. And it just kind of separates the restrictions on height. Smaller ones for smaller kids, uh, taller ones for adults. And I think it gives folks an opportunity to do something different. All of these adventures you can do in just a few hours. But if you really want to try something unique this year, how about trading your entire house for something a bit more rustic? That's right, I'm talking Christmas Eve in a yurt. East Canyon State Park has an impressive slate of these Mongolian tents. The yurts are open all year round. So we've got uh, the heat on for the winter time, the showers on for the summer. You can go ice fishing, especially for later on in the winter time. You can launch a snowmobile, take them out on the lake. We have snowmobiling opportunities on Highway 65 from I-80 over to about mile marker 14. And you can also go to the Mormon Flats Corridor where we have a trail. It's four miles long, you can snowshoe on that trail. Imagine the presence under the tree, a roaring fire and the fun that comes with the new experience. This could truly be a Christmas to remember. Now, I know it can be tough getting trapped in the commercialism, the hustle and bustle of the season, but just remember that's not what it's about. This is about family. This is about creating memories that will be passed down as tales of Christmas's past. And I'm Zach Cipriano for At Your Leisure.